your path to self-discovery. Let's get to know ourselves by understanding how are we emotionally growing into a new version of ourselves each day by understanding our moon sign, how we are designed to shine, our sun sign, and where we are um, becoming more and more self-aware uh, through our rising sign. So let's explore this example of Taurus rising. Taurus rising, we look to Venus, and Venus is in the first house. So very, very instinctually, uh, she's discovering based on how she feels emotionally, how she is instinctually feeling that um, Taurus, what is my basic needs? Where do I feel vulnerable? Where I feel lacking resources so that I can take steps to become more self-sufficient, like attending courses, uh, taking up certificates, becoming competent, learn a new skill set so that I can secure a stable career to meet my basic needs for survival. And how do I do that? And this, when we look at the moon sign, how do I feel emotionally safe and secured? In this case, she's meeting different people, that house. She feels safe, secured to, feel, to meet with different people. And based on how she feels emotionally, what feels comfortable for her, what resonates with her same frequency, she decides uh, to join a new group, which is what she's going through now in the new process of joining a new group. A new group is the 11th house. By joining a new group, uh, she is also creating a new definition because she's breaking away from the old self-definition, 11th house, because her values have changed, Venus. And by joining a new group that she feels emotionally safe, she feels supported, and she can feel free to express herself. And that is how she shines. The sun desire to express in the environment where she feels supported and safe. And this is how she's growing each day into a new version of herself. And why is she doing this? We can look at the underlying unconscious desire of Pluto in our birth chart. In this case, it's in the sixth house. And where Pluto is, is we want to become self-empowered by transforming what is not empowering. So what is not empowering is not feeling safe, um, feeling self-doubt, not feeling secured, not feeling good enough. And that's why um, she wants to learn a new skill set, Venus in first house, and finding the right groups that align with her values, Venus, Taurus, and that supports her so that she can grow in confidence and self-esteem into the next version of herself. And this is how by uh, looking at our sun sign, moon sign, and our rising sign, we can understand how we are growing, evolving each day into a new version of ourselves, our process of becoming. So I hope you'll find this valuable to you and you'll be um, excited to explore your own personal inner path to self-discovery by understanding where is your core desire, what are you transforming, uh, what is the disempowering qualities that we are transforming within us to become more empowered, what is the new awareness that's arising each day, the rising sign, where we are designed to shine, the sun, and how we emotionally is growing each day, our moon, into the next becoming of ourselves. So thank you so much for listening, and I um, hope that um, you will be excited to learn more about yourself from the evolutionary perspective. Thank you so much for listening.